Hello, thank you for visiting Pindakim Art. How's 2023 been treating you so far? I've had a pretty amazing time for the last 10 days. Hope you have had a great time as well. So what I'm going to share today is to make a hentai bouquet arrangement with some colorful flowers. I will be using this spiral technique. If you haven't heard of this, please watch my video right here. As you see flowers on the table, purple, magenta, brown, dark chocolate color. This is one of my favorite color combinations. I looked for some examples of floral arrangements with the color combination. First picture. I made this arrangement for Halloween a few years back. The orange color looks vibrant and I personally satisfied with how I designed. The second arrangement. This style of design is popular. This dark color combination always goes amazing with gold. It looks rich and beautiful, and I also love the design. The third arrangement is grand, and so is the budget. The pear branches and bittersweet vine, beautiful colors of anthuriums, and other floral elements harmonize really well. The fourth arrangement is cute and simple compared to the second and third one. I used three different colors and varieties of tulips, hellebores, and sweet pea. The fifth picture, this arrangement was made for Halloween as the first one. I love color lilies placed at the left and the magnolia leaves. The last picture, two identical looking arrangement. One was meant to place at the left and the other one was meant to place at the right. The arrangement you are singing is the one I'm making today. Okay, let's start. I will explain what florals I used. Purple hyacinths, magenta colors of anemones, white anemones with um, pink inside, dark chocolate colors of dahlia, dried poppy pods, and faux pine cones with sticks. You can find it from the flower market. And rosemary. Somehow it looks similar to Christmas greens to me. Lemon leaf. I prepped already, cut in certain heights and removed leaves at the bottom. Bush ivy. The dark green color and the black berries are looking great. So let's make it. As I mentioned at the beginning, I will make a hentai bouquet using the spiral technique. I will start with hyacinths first. Hold a few stems with the technique and add bush ivy, a lemon leaf and add hyacinths again. I am placing rosemary on top of the hyacinths and turn the bouquet, add more rosemary. The scent is fresh and great. But using rosemary in an arrangement is quite risky because it doesn't really last long. After one or two days, the color turns brown and the lips get dry easily. I turn the bouquet again and add magenta colors of anemone. Look at the beautiful color contrast. After adding two stems of anemones, I put bush ivy under the flowers. Can you see the berries on the bush ivy? I love using them. I keep adding hyacinths and greens. And now I'm putting faux pine cones.
I'm putting white anemone is next to hyacinth. Even with the light pink color inside of this white anemone, I prefer placing close to purple and bush ivies. I'm placing a stem of bush ivy between the white anemone and the hyacinths in order to avoid a strong color contrast. I added one more stem of faux pine cone and placing dark chocolate colors of dahlia next to white anemone. This variety of dahlia has thin stem, so let's put greens under the flower's head to help holding it nicely. The last stem of a white anemone. I'm deciding which spot is perfect for this. I'm adding lemon leaves under the flowers. Magenta anemone is placed between the pine cones and hyacinths. Please keep checking the shape from the top and the side. When you design a floral arrangement, there are a few things to consider. The first thing is color combinations. Let's say there is an order to make for anniversary for a couple. What colors come up on your mind first? I would first think of dark red and purple or shades of pink tons of flowers and greens. The second thing to consider is budget. Well, we are not going to talk about this. The third one to consider is types of flowers. Certain florals are only available in certain times. For example, peony is spring flower. I'm sure you can find peony rarely in winter time, but you need to pay a lot for it. Additionally, certain flowers look more exotic than other florals, such as bird of paradise, anthuriums, and sago palm leaf. Some flowers look fragile and delicate, such as sweet pea, garden roses, peony, and so on. Imagine you use the bird of paradise and sweet pea together. Oh no, well, both don't belong together. The last thing to consider is to decide one or two florals as a show of peace. In other words, which flower you'd like to choose to shine the most. Let's see my arrangement as an example. I would say the main flower of this arrangement is either purple hyacinth or magenta anemone. These flowers are standing out among other elements, I think because of the colors. As you build the hand tie bouquet arrangement, it gets pretty heavy for one hand to hold. I remember I had to make hand tie bouquet arrangement only with tulips, but 200 stems. Oh my gosh, my left hand wasn't functioning well for a few hours. I'm tying it with raffia ribbon and I'm going to add poppy pods. It is fine to add more florals after tying arrangement. Like I mentioned a little ago, when I had to make hand tie arrangement more than $300 or when I only had to use 200 stems of tulips or 100 stems of roses or something even crazier numbers of florals, there's no way of holding all the florals with only one hand. So I tie several times in the process. I saw some designers, they made arrangement in the base first and then tied later. The vase I'm using this time is a clear fishbowl glass base. And I'm putting Aspedistra to enhance the look. 
I'm placing the finished hand tie bouquet arrangement in the space and I'm adjusting details. It is finished. I love how it turned out. The arrangement at the right is an additional piece that I made with um, leftover hyacinths, real pine cones and snowflake ornaments. I hope you like this video. If you got some good tips from it, please thumbs up. So thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.